Hello and welcome to our demo of Hippo Remote, an app that turns your iPhone or iPod Touch into a remote control for your computer. Hippo Remote works with Macs, Windows PCs, Linux PCs, and anything that supports the VNC protocol. This video will give you a quick overview of the basic features of Hippo Remote, so let's get started. I've already saved a connection to my PC, so I can connect with one tap. You can see that I've customized my trackpad with a photo. I see that my screen is locked, and since I don't like typing, I'll bring up the login manager where I've saved my common logins. I'll just tap on the right one, and now I've unlocked my computer. Hippo Remote can now be used as a wireless trackpad and keyboard. Hippo Remote also has built-in profiles for many of your favorite apps. I'm going to choose Windows Media Center. Because I'm using Hippo VNC, Windows Media Center automatically launched when I changed the profile. Every profile gives you a customized layout for that app. This profile has the Windows green button and three overlays to give you access to the full feature set of the program. Many profiles, like this one, also allow you to customize them by adding your own shortcuts or macros. I'll go back to the arrow pad to select the DVD. Now that it's playing, I'll switch to the play pad where I have all the media controls. Now I want to go to a different app. I'll close this one and switch to Firefox. We wanted an easy way to scroll with one hand, so we created circular scrolling. You just touch at the bottom and move your thumb around the center dial to scroll up and down. Now I want to go to a different site, so I'll tap the open button and the web keyboard automatically comes up. Let's take a closer look at the keyboard. In addition to the standard keyboard, you can bring up the arrows and modifier keys, as well as the function keys. Now I'll type the URL. I want to keep the keyboard up, so I'll pin it. Now I want to watch a video. I know I don't need the keyboard after I enter the name, so I'll unpin it. The name is already in my history, so I'll just tap it. Because I've unpinned it, the keyboard is dismissed after I've made my selection. I'll use the trackpad to select the video. At any time I can bring up the keyboard or switch back to the trackpad. This concludes our overview of Hippo Remote. We hope you give Hippo Remote a try. We think you'll really enjoy using it. 